Well, we're nearing the end of our journey, going through the Catawade Marshes. The Catawade Marshes are special, as they lie between the fresh and saltwater channels of the estuary. Catawade marshes lie at the head of the Stort estuary between fresh water and tidal channels of the river. These grazing marshes with their open water and fen habitats support a diverse breeding bird community, which includes species such as rodshank, lorking and oyster catcher. The marshy area helps provide excellent soil for a richer and more prosperous plant community. The long history of grazing on the marsh has maintained its wildlife value. After two days of hard rowing, the event came to a close here in Catawade. Essex and Suffolk water extract thousands of gallons a day to cope with the need of the southeast. This is done by the Catawade Barrage. Built in 1971, it was originally intended to prevent salt water penetrating upstream towards Flatford and its mill, so reducing flooding and enabling the water company to abstract water from the river. These days, your journey from Sudbury to the sea comes to an end with quite a thud on the Catawade Barrage. For the whole way, the river store runs through undulating fields and meadows within a wide valley with pleasant views. Ancient lanes, trees and hedgerows add to its timeless feel. It is perfectly suited for exploring by craft light enough to be portaged and able to negotiate the shallow sections as discovered by most this weekend. Sailing, canoeing and rowing are permitted throughout the length of the river from its source in eastern Cambridgeshire to the sea down here in Catawade. But craft will need to be portaged around fixed structures, many of which these days have long forgotten the industrial and agricultural age in which this river was so heavily used. Thus have been replaced with new locks and weirs. 
Along the length of the river, some portage points may require permission to portage around them from the owner. Sudbury to the Sea runs every year in September and is the only time this permission is organised for the length of the river. We highly advise you take advantage of the planning and hard work that goes into making this event such a success year after year. Twenty-four and a half miles of beautiful Suffolk River. Come to an end here in Catalan. Pylons, water factories, chemical works. A subtle reminder that the store is still very much a working river. Thanks for watching. See you next year.